Why you choose to come and stand in line at to vote? Because I don't know, I'll trust people or not. I just come here to put in the park so I know why, who I am to, to vote. So I don't know if people maybe put the wrong box, it's always, I don't know. I have to go in there to, to make sure that I'm putting the box. After you vote, you turn it into one of the individuals, volunteer who's, who, live, who stays there and they file the vote, either in machine or physically, to wait for November 3rd. Because, see, we cannot open this, this voting going on right now. Um, it goes into an envelope, and we cannot open it until November 3rd. Last question to you is, what, in your opinion, is, is responsible for the tsunami of voters that flooded the polling stations on the first day of of early voting? I think people um, honestly are afraid that their votes won't count. I think it's a combination of things. There are people who voted early who would normally win on election day. I think the conversations we've seen about around mail-in voting, potential um, voter fraud being thrown out there, terminology being thrown around, has challenge people to make sure they get out in person and they recognize that the reality is you have two weeks to vote. That's the truth. Mm -hmm. The election day is one day, but you have two whole weeks to get out and vote in person. And so I think they've just created that awareness that the traditional voting day where you get off work does not, is not the only way to do it. COVID has created that, and some of the rhetoric from our political candidates have created that awareness and that that drive to get out and vote that I haven't seen, even through the Obama years. I felt great. Uh, the weather was good. It's the first day of voting. I came later on this afternoon because I know the, understand the lines were way back there. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I'm glad to get it out the way.